What's up, everybody? It's your boy, the Nutty Ninja. We're back again with some more Red Dead Redemption 2. In this video, we're going to be continuing off with the story. Uh, so far, all I've been doing in, uh... Oh, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, sure. Whatever you say, buddy. You, I had to save your ass last video. Um, anyway, so, yeah, we're, uh... Basically, yeah, we're uh, basically going to continue off with the story mode. Have All I've been doing most is doing a little free roaming and a few side missions here and there, trying to get some cash. Uh, and uh, trying to get my honor up. Uh, trying to max it out. I'd rather be an honorable outlaw than a dishonorable one. I'm still looking fresh as hell. Got a new uh, jacket. I think it really completes the look with the chaps and whatnot. Pretty much uh, the whole outfit is just bought. I, uh, even the boots. I had, I had the same, like, boots... That, uh, that came with the uh, came with my other outfits on for most of the videos, but yeah, I finally got some still new stuff. And uh, for this video, we're going to be doing the John Marston mission, which uh, I guess we're going to help John with whatever endeavor he has. What up, bro? What's up, Johnny boy? What, what you got? Want? Uncle told me something about a train. Uh, oh yeah. Oh, this could this could be an opportunity to get some more cash though. Something about a train full of wealthy folk rolling down through Scarlet Meadows, just south of State Border. Uh huh. You need help with it? I ain't uh, sure doing it. Come on, at night, not too. Oh, what you mean, not sure? We're, we're, we're of course we're doing it. I need the cash. No, stopping the train, pain in the ass. Sure, but what if we could force a train to stop? <laughs> well, like how a dynamite we get a blow the tracks? Full of something flammable, oil. Put it on the tracks. They see. Uh -huh. They know they either have to stop or die. Ain't no train driver wants to be cooked alive. That's true. That's true. That is kind of brilliant uh, for you. <laughs> <laughs> of course, you gotta add the idea. insult in there. I think that's the first time you ever had one of them. <laughs> Shut up. You might be the first bastard to ever have half his brains eaten by a wolf and end up more intelligent. <laughs> yeah, I love this guy, man. I love these little interactions. Guns look real frightening, and some dynamite to open up the train. I'll get the supplies. Got to head into town for Abigail anyway. Oh, uh, okay. You, you go find us an oil wagon. Yeah, I know just the place. They're always heading into that refinery. There's an old rundown shack just over the border, north of a place called Dewberry Creek. Leave it hidden somewhere near there. Okay. Sweet. Sweet. So we're gonna rob a train and get some money. Beard's growing in nice and thick. Uh, hopefully it gets even, even thicker. If it stops uh, growing naturally, I'm going to have to use some hair tonic. When it unlocks, of course. Excuse me. Alright then, let's mark it on the... Well, it should already be marked by default. So, yeah. Anyway. Wait, wait, wait. What's that there? M. What's the M there? There's an M. What mission is that? I can't... Hold on, what is it? Micah Bell... I asked you to meet him at his camp near Strawberry. Oh, Micah. Wait, what? Wait a minute. Uh, Micah, bro, you're gonna have to wait. I'm in the middle of something right now. You're gonna have to wait on, to wait on that, brother. Sorry. Alright, uh, oil wagons. Alright, right there. Alright, sweet. So we'll head to the oil wagons. Let me mark them. I'm, I'm actually kind of wanted in there, too. Luckily, it's the bounty's only like 30 bucks. I'm Austrian. Hey. Oh. Oh. So what do they eat in Austria? Time to go, boy. Alright, come on, nutty babe. Woo! Okay, so I wonder who's all gonna help us uh, hit this, uh, do this heist for the train? Is it just gonna be me and Johnny Boy, or somebody else joining in with us too, like Bill or something? Gonna have to make an example out of some folks, I suppose. I need to buy myself some new uh, revolvers and pistols too. Uh, I get me wrong, I like the Cattleman revolvers a lot. It's just you know, it's always good to have upgraded tech. You know, I really should upgrade my. Uh, so far, my revolvers have been fully maxed out on upgrades and design and whatnot. I need to focus more on upgrading my other weapons too. But you see, gotta keep get that cash up because upgrades are kind of expensive when it's when you have like several weapons to do them for. We'll find this, uh, find this wagon, and we'll be able, all prepped and ready to go to go rob this damn train. Bro, I look so fly in this outfit. Like, so fly. 
Alright, now heading to the location there. And, uh, yeah. Just freaking. What is this a shipping yard? What is this? Oil refinery? Probably gotta sneak in this bitch, too. I'm guessing that's the guard. Okay, my bad. Don't get all worked up. All right, no. Sure, it's private. Okay. Okay, well I gotta get in there, buddy. So, there's a uh, there's one or two ways we can do this. I can sneak in, or I can kill the guard and uh, be on my way. Um, hopefully he won't see me. So I'm gonna go around the side here. Which realistically he put a, we would have been saw me, but you know. Um, all right. There's a side. All right, here's a side opening over here. All right. So long as he doesn't see me, and there's another damn guard. All right, come on, come on, come on. While his back's turned, take off as smooth as you like. Nice and easy now, come on. And pulled off without a hitch, baby. <laughs> Wait, what? What, what? Wait, uh-uh. How did you... How? No, there was nobody watching me when I did this. Well, it's too late now. I'm already gone. Kind of. <laughs> oh, wait, this stuff is... What are you doing? This stuff is flammable. The hell? These guards retarded? Jesus, my dude, stop, please. Yeah. Alright, does he not know what his own stuff is carrying here? Hold on a second. I'm about, to say, I'm about to blow them, I'm about to blow them away because they're causing me trouble. Alright. That's how you want to play it. Hang on, yeah. I'm gonna watch you. What? Sorry, I couldn't hear you. Yeah, sorry, but I couldn't hear you over those uh over those five or four three bullets I've put in your chest. All right, yeah, it's a bit grisly and brutal, but it had to be done. They wouldn't leave me alone. I tried to tell them to stop. But apparently, he felt the need to shoot at something carrying highly highly combustible uh, fluids. So yeah. Besides, they got another one. It's not like it's not like it's gonna be missed much. I'll show you. Oh god! No, no, please tell me. That. Wait, what? What? No! Did I die or did it? Or was it? Or was it? You gotta be kidding me! Really? So wait, what did I? What happened? Did I die or did I ruin the freaking uh, carriages? Okay, let's not drive off any more cliffs. Okay. <laughs> Alright. First of all, let me set a waypoint because I don't even know where I'm going. Oh wait, I'm actually almost I'm almost there actually. Huh. Alright. That's good to know. Very convenient. <gasps> oh excuse me, I got sixty-eight bucks in cash. This probably isn't gonna help my wanted level either. All right, here we are. Wait, do I have to pull it in there or? Yeah, I can't see squat. Hold up. Wait a minute, hang on now. Yep. These things are, are are a bitch to turn though, for real. Okay, pulling on in the yard there. I don't have to steal two of these things, do I? Alright, all set. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, what now? Till John, uh... 
back at the camp, the wagon is in position. Okay. Where's my horse? Come on. Well, that was a fairly easy mission. I only died like once. Is my horse really too far away for me to call? Bro. Where is it? I gotta go all the way back there to get my horse? You serious? Oh my god. Oh, uh, my freaking. Okay. Jesus Christ. Is that a, what's that, a raccoon? I want a raccoon. So much trouble. I gotta go all the way back here for this damn horse. What? Damn. Horse is at a whistling range still. All right, y'all, we're gonna try to get my horse back and be on our way. Oh, good, my stamina is at level eight. I need to, I need to freaking get my uh, dead eye upgraded. No, honestly, once I figure out how to do that, maybe I'll last a little longer in gunfights. All right. All right, relax, Arthur, brother. Relax. Okay, tell me at least I'm getting a little closer now. Yeah, I thought I'm sitting here thinking the horse was gonna follow me and whatnot. All right. Horses, come on. How much closer do I need to be? Uh, I might have to end up stealing somebody's horse. Screw this. Alright, there's the train yard. There's the freaking, not the train yard. The, uh, what is that? The oil plant or whatever the freak. Okay. Let's try it now. Every time. Okay, a little closer then. <coughs> Excuse me. Need to eat something too, cause my health, my health is freaking bread chunks. Yeah, I, I eat the bread chunk that I stole from that camp. I also need to make myself some uh, poison knives too, once I find the right ingredients. Okay. Damn that horse! Come on, nutty babe. You're supposed to be like my go-to. Why are you so freaking? All right, maybe just a little closer, and we'll probably be good. All right, what about now? Not again. Uh. All right. Now, please tell me it's coming now. Okay, I think it is. For love of God, finally. How do I rest? I could have sworn there was like a way I could rest. Wait, is Nutty Babe coming? Alright, maybe just, she just she, he's, he's just taking his sweet time. The hell? Wait, the hell he? This thing just came out of nowhere. What the freak? Hold up. What? I know you don't think you're gonna ram me and think you're gonna get away with that. Ah, uh, you stay right there, buddy, okay? Maybe next time you won't. This little bastard came out of nowhere and just rammed me. The hell? That's what you get. The free? Don't come out of nowhere and ram me. Nutty babe, where are you? I have a pelt here. But I know I whistled for this horse like five times already. That was the weirdest thing I've ever experienced. A, a big ass goat just came out of nowhere. Out of nowhere. And stabbed me in the ass. Don't know why he did it. He just did. 
Right, I have to come back for that deer. For that man, for that goat. Alright, come on now. More than close enough. Come on. Is he stuck on something? What the freak? Come on, I don't want to lose the I don't want to lose the goat co uh, corpse. You gotta be kidding me, bro! Come on, nutty babe! Come on, baby! Come on now! I'm right here. You have to hear me! Come on! The hell took you so long, bro? All right, come here. Hold still. I got a pelt. Next time, how about you just follow me? That'd be nice. Okay, let's go back and hopefully that goat uh, corpse is still there. Yep. Hey. Little bastard deserves to get skinned. I'm gonna come up behind me. Now I'm just minding my own business. That sky is beautiful. Look at that. Just minding my own business. Man, he comes out of nowhere and, and just freaking takes it upon himself to stab me in the ass and hit me from behind. The both, both the dirtiest thing any animals that ever done to me in this entire game, and I rarely get kicked by horses. All right, let's get going. Where's John at? I hope he's at the freaking camp so I can just get this. Oh, he is nice. So I could donate this. Actually, now I think about it. Would I be re would it be better off if I just sell this uh, pelt at the freaking butcher, or should I just say freaking? I don't know. I really need to upgrade my um. Wait a minute, there's another one. I mean, well, since I'm right here, I might as well. Where'd it go? I didn't even see where it went. Where'd it go? I didn't even see where the thing ran off to. Uh, he must have saw. I must have had his uh, his cousin on my uh, horse right here. <laughs> All right, whatever. We're gonna let's just head to the mission. Wait, there's something up here. What is this? More goats? I hope it is. Oh well, look, look at that. I think it is. Too bad they're not gonna get away. But what the hell? Did not mean Whoa. to do that. Jesus Christ. Is that pelt still good? I hope it is. A pronghorn. I never heard of that. Basically just trampled the poor bastard with my horse. Nutty babe killed him. Rolled up and ready to go. It's poor. Oh, come on. Well, I mean, I mean, it's not like I shot it. I just, I just trampled a little on my horse. Let's go, boy. Don't worry, nutty babe. I'll get that blood off of you. Yeah. All right, let's keep going there. The train is gonna, the, a conductor or an engineer is gonna have one. It's me, Bill. Hey. Bill, shut your dumb ass up. All right, let's go. Excuse me, people. Hello, Mr. Hello there, madam. What are you, what you doing, Reverend? Hello, Mr. Morgan. Have you gotten control of yourself yet? Are you? Have you been a good lad? I hate to think you're out and about doing what you did before. You know, getting everybody's goddamn nerves. Oh, ew! Look at all that blood on my jacket, bro. Ugh. I should be more presentable than this. Look at that. Look at that, man. I just bought this jacket like early, like earlier during the day. Heck. All right. Donate. All right. We can see you got perfect. Ah, now I can goat carcass. Special. Hello? Like what? Boom. All right. That's all I'm gonna give you. 
Thank you, thank you. I try. I'm, I'm trying, brother. Really, I am. I, it's just that you ask for so damn much. Okay, I got it. this one. Perfect deer, perfect deer pelt, perfect elk pelt, and perfect panther pelt. Uh, I believe you. I believe you. Uh, perfect deer pelt, da 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 da, da beaver, rabbit. Wait, that one seems the easiest to make. Deer, beaver, and rabbit. Ah, I think I, I think I can find those. I think I can manage to get those. Yeah. Yeah, I think I can manage that. I just have to remember which one that is. No, what about the lodgings? I really want to upgrade the lodgings. Alligator. Jesus, Pierce. All right. Pierce does not make this stuff easy. All right, excuse me. Watch out. Why are you fall? Damn, bro. Personal space or nah? Right, let's go talk to Johnny Boy. Oh, Johnny Boy. What's up, bro? Look, so I found what I needed. Get on. Good. And you? Got everything we need. Good. Sweet. Let's get it on. We need another man. Charles? I'll go get him. Meet us at the wagon when you can. Sure. See you, Arthur. Ain't that dumb. <laughs> Next time, let the wolves eat all your brain. Then you'll be a genius. <laughs> <sighs> Alright, meet you at the freaking... Alright, yeah. What's that? Abigail Roberts? Abigail needs to speak to me? Oh God, what'd I do? Yeah, you know, when a woman needs to speak to you, it's always about some crap you done did. <laughs> oh my God. Alright, so, I'm gonna just take a guess and assume she doesn't really fully agree with the decision to rob this train and she's probably gonna get mad at me for going along with it or she's gonna ask me to make sure I keep John safe. I'm calling her right now. I bet my hat. That's what this conversation is going to be about. I can't see her though. What the freak? Uh, Abigail, what's your cute ass want, girl? Hi, Arthur. Come here a minute. What up? Can I ask you a favor? What kind no, of favor? Not. Very funny. Would you do something with Jack? Uh. He's kind of down. All this upheaval can't have been easy on the poor kid. Why? Because I'm your preferred nursemaid because you do what you say huh please why me okay. jack john is the father thank you okay so wait what why don't you ask john he's the father i think that's more of the role for his father to do not me jesus abigail all right then All right, let's go get little Jack and do something with him. Where's cute little Jack? Oh, there he is playing in the freaking. Look at that horse, bro. What kind of horse is that? I want one. Hey, Jackie boy. What you up to? Playing. Anything for? Listen how cutie sounds, bro. You want to come fishing with me? Fishing? Sure. You're the it's about time that you start to earn your cape. Yeah, nice. Good. Let's, a... Let's go get your pole then. Now, you do have a fishing pole, don't you? Interesting choice of words, Arthur. <laughs> made me one. Good. Well, let's go get it then. Let's go catch us some fish. <laughs> yeah. Mount your horse. All right. A good thing I'm already kind of somewhat dressed for the cold. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm not going to let the kids sit on my bloody ass horse. Let me clean it first. Wait a minute now, Jack. Hang on now. Alright. Hold on tight. Well, at least he isn't sitting in the blood. Just down to the river near here. He shouldn't go too far from camp. Oh, okay. You feeling better? I know you was a little sick. Oh, I'm fine. You're so I probably gotta take it easy with the kid on the front. Oh, just like you. I don't know about brave. I ain't much of a kid no more. Though your mama might disagree. Her and a few other women, I guess. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, yeah. Just talking silly. Yeah. <laughs> a tough few weeks.
wakes up in that snow. I like the snow. Me too, kiddo. Me too. When are we going back to the other camp? The one near Blackwater? Yeah. Uh, will I not have a bounty on my head? <laughs> Dear God, Jack just sounds so innocent. Really? When? Well, <laughs> we'll see. Got fish to catch first. All right. This looks as good a spot as any. Damn, Jack must be light for you to lift my one arm like that. <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna go try doing some fishing. I have not done any fishing in this game yet. Come on, follow me. Look how small he is, bro. Little Jack. I can't wait to get started. Yeah, me too, kiddo. Me too. Just by the water there? You mean? Yep. Just by the water. Alright. Item wheel. What am I looking for here? Oh, I got bait? Select fi I have a fishing when did I get a fishing rod? When did I get a fishing rod? First. The hell? We need some bait. When did I get all of this? I don't even remember getting you this. Okay. Use some cheese. Cheese? Cheese? The the better. Now, cast your line. Swing the rod back over your shoulder. Okay. Bring it forward in a smooth motion. Use your wrist, not your elbow. Like that? Oh, yeah, yeah, pretty good, kid. Still wonder where I got these fishing supplies from. How do I know when I've got a bite? Trust me, you'll know. Feel the tip of your fishing rod just twitching. Don't yank it yet. That just means one's nibbling. If you feel a hard tug, that's a fish going for the bait. So yank hard to hook it. I think you've got a bite. Yeah. Fish on the line. I see. I see. So uh, I gotta keep this thing under control or something. And quickly rotate the real fish while it is tired. Okay, so I gotta get it while it's tired. Gotcha. Oh, we got our first fish, boys. A rock bass? Bro, you. Uh, I really want to keep this fish, but whatever. We'll throw it back. Can I take a break from fishing? We only just got started. Okay. Okay. Well, uh, what did you have in mind? You can go ahead and do that. Some of those red flowers. Huh? What red flowers? Hang on now, kid. Stay in view now. Your mama will kick my nuts if I freaking let something happen to you. Alright. Let's see what's biting there. Oh, looks like I got a bite. I can't look like something's gonna happen to old Jack, uh, little Jack. I hope not. You got a stick at things, Jack. I know. <laughs> look what I'm doing. Boring. Boring. Boring as hell. But then, something happens. Yeah. You can get food for days. Really? If you're lucky. But until then, you just sit, and wait, and try not to worry. We probably gotta reset the cast, it's yeah. It's good for you. I guess. Some sorts, I suppose. Let me try a different spot. Let me go down here hey, with Jack. Look at this. And what? That's this cool. Necklace I made. Necklace? For Mama. Sure. Oh, he's, he's a fine this young man. He is just too innocent it's for this world. Complex circumstances. Who are you? Arthur, isn't it? Arthur Morgan? 
Who are you? All right, we yes. got. Let's have got a problem. Arthur Morgan, Vanderlyn's most trusted associate. Don't he make me kill you in front of this kid. Typical case: orphan street kid seduced by that maniac silver tongue and matures into a degenerate murderer. Agent Milton. Agent Ross. Pinkerton. Oh God, is Ross? Seconded to the United States government. Okay. Nice to finally meet. We know a lot about you. Do you? You're a wanted man, Mr. Morgan. And what the hell are you gonna do about it, punk? For your head alone. Five thousand dollars. I can use that. Can I turn myself in? We want Vanderlyn. No I don't know what to tell you. I haven't seen him for months. That's so. Because I heard a guy fitting his description robbed a train belonging to Leviticus Cornwall up near Granite Pass. Well, I never heard anything about that. Old fashioned nowadays. Apparently not. Listen. I can't, man, I want to shoot this Ross right off the bat right Mr. now. Morgan. Bring in Vanderlyn, and you have my word you won't swing. Oh, I ain't going to swing anyways, Agent uh, Milton. Yeah. See, I haven't done anything wrong, aside from not play the games to your rules. Spare me the philosophy lesson. I've already heard it from Mac Callender. Mac Callender? He was pretty shot up by the time I got to him. Uh -huh. Really, it was more of a mercy killing. Slow, but merciful. Right. <laughs> you enjoy being a rich man's toy, dear. I enjoy society, flaws and all. You people venerate savagery, and you will die. Savagely, all of you. Oh, we're all gonna die. Oh, I doubt it. Some of us sooner than others. Good day, Mr. Morgan. Goodbye. Oh. Make sure you Enjoy don't turn your back on me, Morgan. Why you still can. <laughs> Who are they? Some assholes. No one to worry about. No one at all. Come on. Well, let's go back let's to fishing. Your things and get home. <laughs> Tell you, I would have put a bullet in his back right now. All right, where's my horse? It's getting late, Jack. Your mother would be worried. Let's head back. Now, first of all, before we do, let me at least clean his blood off. Yes, Jack, we will. Let me just clean it off Nutty Babe. Alright, alright, relax. Just gotta clean Nutty Babe off because that blood stain is. Jack, can you please, bro, learn some patience. Learn some patience. I will take you back. Just gotta get this blood off of him. Stubborn. All right, finally. Good God. Come on, little Jackie boy. Man, I swear, if Ross was turning his back on me, I would have put a built bullet in him. Heck, if he was looking at me funny, I would have put a bullet in him. But luckily, little Jack here is gonna take care of that for us, ain't you, buddy? <laughs> Why did you lie about where Uncle Dutch is? Cause none of their goddamn business. Well. Because those are disagreeable men, and I don't want them to hurt him. What did they mean about Mac? Is he in jail? Uh. No, I don't uh, think so. I hope he's just fine where he is. Like I said, don't right, worry about them. The world is full of disagreeable men. That's why you got all of us to protect you from folk like them. Damn right. You still got it, right? Yeah, I got it. Good. Well, did you like fishing? He said it was boring. Okay, I think. It's a lot of waiting around. That's true. Hey there, Abigail. The cute ass. There you are. How you boys getting on? Well, it could have been better if somebody wouldn't put a shotgun in my face. That pretty. Not the luckiest. Did you thank Uncle Arthur? No need. We had a good time. What's wrong? Nothing. Just met some folk. I better go speak with Dutch. Okay. Hey. You did real fine, kid. Thanks. I swear Jack is just too innocent for this world. 
What? Especially that age. Some guys out near the river. A fella named um, Milton and uh, I don't remember the other fella's name. Ross. Milton and Ross. And, and they are employees of the Pinkerton Detective Agency. And they know about the train and they know we're here. Were you followed back here? No. They know we're near here. And they want you, Dutch. They offered me my freedom in exchange, they did. As if they'll really keep their word. What do you mean, why didn't I take it? Well, what do we do now? I say we do nothing. What? Yeah. If you're trying to scare us into doing something stupid, we have turned a corner. We survived them mountains. We just need to stay calm. All right. If you say so. All right, yeah. Look at that angle, though. Jesus. It looks sinister. All right, then. Well, that's out of the way. All right, I think that's pretty much it, then. All right? Wait, no. We still haven't done the uh, freaking... The train mission, did we? Let me see here. Where is that at? Over here? Okay, so yeah, we'll... Alright, I'll tell you what, I'll end the video here and then we'll continue off by helping John with the train mission. So guys, drop a like if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe to see more videos like this one. And I'll catch you all in the next Red Dead Redemption 2 video. Later guys, love ya. Goodbye.